the eye is one of the most important parts of our body. But how does the eye see? First, light comes in through the cornea, which focuses light and passes it through the pupil. The lens then bends the light into the retina, which is located in the back of the eye. The retina has hundreds of millions of cells called rods and cones. The cone cells are the ones responsible for sensing color, and there are three different types of cone cells, each one corresponding to a different wavelength of light. So the cone cells react to their optimal wavelength, sending signals to the brain through the optic nerve. And that is the reason we can't see light outside of the visible light spectrum, because our cone cells simply don't react to those wavelengths. But what if I told you that now you can see light outside the visible light spectrum? That's right. Recently, science has developed a contact lens that goes into your eye and lets you see light outside the visible light spectrum, specifically infrared. The contact lens lets you see light outside the visible light range through a process called photon upconversion. The contact lens is coated with tiny nanoparticles, including ytterbium and erbium, which are crucial in the process. Normally, these atoms are in their ground states, meaning that their electrons are in the lowest possible energy level they can be. But when an infrared photon hits ytterbium, it excites the atom, meaning electrons in the atom can jump to higher energy levels. Another infrared photon comes in and does the same thing to a different ytterbium atom. The energy is then transferred to erbium through a process called FRET, moving the erbium to an excited energy state. And when the erbium atom inevitably calms down, it releases its energy as a visible photon of light, which is something the eye can see.